All right, guys, it's Leanne here, and it's time for X Fat Chick Confesses. Now, I've been getting emails and questions asking me different things about how I've lost the weight and how I've kept it up and what my secrets are. So this is my turn to just answer some of your questions for you, and I'm not going to hold anything back. Uh, today, this question comes from Lindsay in Annapolis, and she asked, what did I do basically to flip the switch, to make the decision to change my life? And the way I look at it, it's two things that happen. The first thing is I made it a priority. I made a decision that it was going to happen, okay? I knew I had other things going on in my life, and I knew that I wanted this really badly. And it was basically one of those things where I just had to decide that I was going to do it, and I wasn't going to stop no matter what stood in my way. You could have literally pried me off of the treadmill or pried me off out of my workouts and I would not have budged. That's how determined I was. So the first thing I would say is just get yourself really, really determined. And if you're not ready to go, don't fool yourself, okay? Make sure that you, you're you ready for what you're about to embark upon because you know what? It's hard work. You're gonna be, you're gonna be working your butt off. You're gonna be changing your life, but it's so worth it. And the second thing is is that I think I had it set in my mind. I was what I call automatic success mode is where you set your mind in that success mode. But the opposite of that, I guess it would be automatic failure mode. I basically just, no matter what I attempted to do, I always had the thoughts that it just wasn't gonna happen, that I wasn't gonna really achieve my goals. And when you make up your mind, whether it's a good thing or a bad thing, you've, made, you've locked that answer in, you've sealed the deal. And so I, for so many years, just basically thought what's the use what is the point of even trying and um, I made up my mind that it wasn't gonna happen that I, it wasn't gonna happen for me so once I made up my mind and flipped that switch the other way it's just about making decisions make a commitment um, one thing that I'll leave you with is that you know a, f a few months ago I was kind of sitting around with my last you know five or ten pounds of fat and I just I'd come so far and I really wanted to take it the whole way and basically I got real with myself and I said you know Leanne you're not doing what you need to be doing. You're not doing the extra cardio. You're not really, you know, dialing your food as much as you should. And you know what I did? I did a really powerful thing. I made myself a little six week challenge and I created an entire calendar. And basically it was a, just a vigorous workout program for six weeks. And I knew I was gonna be, you know, um, dialing in my food. And what I did is I went over to my parents' house who lived down the road for me. Um, I'm not in Florida right now, you can tell. And I literally walked up to them, handed them that, that six week calendar and I said, this is what, is going to take place over the next six weeks and I'm not going to stop what I started I'm going to finish it till the end and on August 28th which was the day of the end of it if I haven't completed this entire thing you can say to me this is one more thing that you started and didn't finish and I know it was really important to me and that's why I created the calendar in the first place so I knew I just needed something in me whether it was somebody else's accountability or my own and what do you know, I completed the six weeks, I lost my last, ten, last, last 10 pounds of fat, and I'm feeling amazing about myself. And the only thing that separated myself from the Leanne of a few weeks before that is I just changed my mind. I made a decision, I held myself accountable, and I just went with it full force. Because you know what? You have the ability to do anything you want if you actually just make the decision to go do it. So this is X Fat Chick Confesses, and I'll see you next time.